Oh, shit, man, shit. What do we do in times of crisis? Three, two, one. Yeah. All right. We have a present right here. It's a very sexy, very nice box, all right? Now, that's a bad choice of wording, but I just got fucking paint on my hand. This, are you filming me too, Tuesday? That's not allowed. Excuse me. No, I'm not happy about this paint on my finger. Anyway, I said, I made a little, little, little cheeky, cheeky posty before, right? Saying I ordered something, something by this lovely company, which you may have recognized fucking everywhere. If you like motorcycles, there's ads everywhere. But this is a box, all right? This, inside this very box, there is a surprise. Now, I already know what this surprise should be. But if you were watching the last one, you would have only seen one thing. Now, this box right here is the shockwave. Now, this is the Bluetooth module, all right? Made in China, very nice. But this goes straight into the helmet, right? Plugs right into the back of it. It's a cool little thing. I'll, I'll pull out a little bit if I can figure out how to. It's just one of those friction boxes, the worst kinds. Because you, you just got to... Eh. Eh. There we go. See this little, this little knick-knack thing? This little, little, little Lego piece? Right in the back. Bob's your uncle, mate. She'll be good. And there's a, there's a QR code, right? The journey, I'm guessing that's instructions because these things look complicated. So let's put this bitch right back in there and begin phase two. So that's the box, all right? This one looks a little bit more interesting. And by that, I mean, it's, it's in there. So I may have to do the old, um... Maybe take out the table. No, 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 it's fine. Oh my word. Friction fitting's a piece of shit, I'll tell you that much. Fantastic. So in front of me, I have a box. Inside set box. You'll see Atlas 4.0. Now apparently the three is real windy and I really wanted the raging one, but I didn't get that. First up, what is this? We're not gonna look at the main attraction. That's too much fun. My little GoPro man, the little, little chin chin thing. Very nice. So, I get a nice little Ruach bottle opener. Oh, look at that, uh, look at that. Now, there's another little goodie in here, the pin lock. Now, this is a um, self-tinting one, so when the sun hits your eyes, you don't go blind. Because I don't really want to commit to the, um, the dark one all the time, because I like to ride at all times of day and go out and stay out. Now, I'm not going to look at that one just yet. I'm guessing these little um, things for your ears inside the helmet. I don't quite know. I think that's what that is. If you look over here, could you tell what this is? I can't. I'm guessing this is the dark visor because I think it ships with the clear one on and I think I am correct. So that's the dark visor. I'm not gonna take that fully out just cause dust and stuff and I'm an OCD fucking freak and I don't want that. But if you look over here, the meat and potatoes, that is a nice helmet. It feels very nice. Now, if you'll excuse me for about 30 years, I'm gonna try and undo a knot because your boy can't do the knots because I'm not a scout leader boy. Three, two, uh. Now, would you look at that? That is a helmet right there. All right, now this, we're just gonna have to do a little. Oh, doesn't that look like sex? That is a beautiful helmet, that is. Now, hopefully, the main question is, will it fit? My hair needs to... Oh, my. You haven't taken off the... <laughs> Ooh, I know, don't worry. <laughs> now, this thing fits significantly tighter than my other helmet does. My other one goes, whoa, but this one, she's on there. And she's on it tight, so that ain't going nowhere. Now, you'll notice this one's not got one of those old-fashioned ones. This is um, it's a different locking mechanism, and I don't quite 
don't quite know it yet. It's going to take me a while. Oh, look at that. And then you pull this little, nice and easy. Oh my God. How do I look? Is it beautiful? Was it worth the money? I like it so far. But yes, this is the Rurok Atlas 4.0. What is this one called? The Fenrir, I believe. Fenrir. Yes, I was stuck between many. There was... Oh, baby. There was this one, Jormungundur. And oh, what's the other one that I really like? It's the, I don't know the name, but it's the um, one that's modeled after the Day of the Dead. Now, I don't know what that one is, but this... I like it. I like it a lot. Now you'll notice this thing's on a much nicer chin curtain. Now I never showed you my one. My one had this really, really open one. And what I did to it is I got uh, my dear old mother to sew some fabric on there because it was too much noise. But this thing, you'll see it's got the, uh, the old vent here, which they changed from the older ones instead of having to buy separate vents to actually like, you know, listen around your helmet. But yeah, so that's that nice matte color with a nice shine to the gold. The padding inside is very comfortable. It's nice and firm. The weight of the helmet is not bad. I believe this is a carbon one, but yeah, that's everything inside the box for the Rurok helmet. And holy fuck, man, that's fucking delightful, that is. But yeah, I'm keen. I'll peel this shit off later and install that other stuff up and put those Bluetooth goody goodies in there. But yes, that's the Atlas 4.0. And I think I'll review it very soon. Anyway, take it easy, keep it cheesy. Peace. Smack. All right, now that's uh, me cheeky little unboxing. Now there will be a review of this helmet sometime soon. I have to wear the fucker, but there's gonna be some storms coming. And uh, I don't know if you follow Melbourne weather, that doesn't mean they're gonna be there because last week it was meant to be raining and I yet to see a single fucking drop. Unlike Queensland, which is a swimming pool right now. But all my links are in the description. I've got a fucking Discord channel and I stream on Twitch quite a lot. Definitely Monday to Wednesday, but I don't follow that regime. I keep going because I'm an animal. Now this video looks a bit nicer than usual because my girlfriend helped out. She has a nice camera, not um not my old GoPro and a mobile phone that I don't know how to operate because I'm not a cameraman. Anyway, take it easy, keep it cheesy. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe. Bye. I love what you're scrubbing with. It's so cute. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> Oh, dear, nanny, got a nanny, got a nanny, got a nanny, man,